want you guys to know that my family does not want me to be a stripper. They do not understand under that kind of stuff. That is all my idea. They want me to marry a nice Jewish boy. That's right. <laughs> who, is this myth who is this mythical creature? Please raise your hand if you're right here. Nobody? No, nobody, huh? Because they don't exist. <laughs> A nice Jewish boy is a mythical person that has a nice job, drives a nice vehicle. Somebody who, whose grandmother, my grandmother, met at Plummer Park, which is where all the Russians hang out. <laughs> and that is pretty much it. And, you know, I personally did not want to go out with the Jews myself. I figured that dating like a Russian Jew here for me, it's like, it's like living in front of an international food, food court and always eating gefilte fish at your grandma's house. <laughs> oh, Brazilian food, no thank you, I don't want it. Tonight we have chopped liver, tomorrow we have chopped herring. We have all kinds of other chopped fishes, but we do not want your Brazilian restaurant. No thank you very much. But you know, there was a lot of pressure from my family. They pressured me about it. And uh, I went out with a lot of ugly guys. A lot of ugly guys that are kind of boring. And if I said, you know, grandma, he's ugly, my grandma would be like, what? He no good looking? He no look good. No look at him. <laughs> he is doctor. He give you all the medicine you need. <laughs> I say, grandma, he's boring. Oh my God, he boring? Oh my God, no listen to him. <laughs> is man circus? Man is not circus. He has car dealership. Think about it. <laughs> if I did not want to go out with the ugly Jews, my grandma brought out the big guns. Do you guys know what the big guns is? The big guns is I came to America for you. <laughs> ah, in Russia I was big doctor. People come to me from over the place. They bring me money. They bring me candy. They bring me goat. Do I take? No. I come to America for you, and now I sit here, and you no marry nobody. <laughs>